All right, what's up, y'all? We got a very special video today. We are at the Blossom. We're about to go downstairs to Lavo Lavo, where they're all-you-can-eat brunch. Apparently, they have some great brunch with nice view. So, let's get to it. All right, y'all. So, as you guys can see, we are right outside of the Lavo Lavo on, at the Palazzo lobby right here. It looks very nice, very chic. So yeah, let's go get some brunch, guys. Ooh, it's very nice in here. It's a little bar. Got on here with her drink. Oh, are you recording me? Yeah. <laughs> So this is actually you can see the fresh pasta bar where they're cooked in front of you right here but yeah that's why all the pasta is so good because they make it fresh to order right all right y'all looks like everybody's having a good time in here having mimosas and brunch see that right there you see those mimosas so this place is pretty beautiful guys not gonna lie this place looking like the next big thing yeah there's like an upstairs patio so we are very lucky to be here for their endless Italian brunch because it's actually only on the weekends and it's Saturday today. So only Saturday and Sunday, no Fridays, starting at 10 to 3. So I'm going to explain the man menu a little bit for you guys. So it's $50, all you can eat brunch, and, but there's actually a couple items on the brunch menu that like you pay extra like $15 and you can get like a full steak or a full entree. But we're not going to do that. We're just going to stick to the brunch and it's $30 for our bottomless mimosas. I don't know if we're gonna get that yet, but the menu looks promising. There's a lot of uh, interesting things. There's oysters, salmon tartare, tuna tartare, and a bunch of pastas. So I think we're gonna go straight for those. So this is a uh, New York State of Mind. It's supposed to be one of their best cocktails. Cheers. Cheers. I've got the almost Try it out. Ooh, this is good. So it's like a whiskey sour. Has a lemony taste. Ooh, that's a good that's a good cocktail right there. It was recommended by our waiter. He didn't do us wrong. guys so the raw oysters just got here I think this is the best thing on the menu you gotta get the bang for your buck when you go to all you can eat and if you guys can get raw oysters at all you can eat and they're good you're in the right place but we'll have to judge them to see how good they are all right y'all the moment of truth the oysters let's see how they are with a little spoon yeah comment down below how you have your oysters put a little bit of Tabasco a little bit of ketchup cocktail sauce and limon. Time to slurp up the oysters, the aphrodisiac. Mmm. Wow. For all you can eat lobster, it's pretty solid. Fresh, cold. All you could really ask for. Not the best oysters, but solid. So it's a very basic dish. The French toast, but at a brunch spot. You always gotta judge the brunch spot by the French toast. Let's see how it is. Let's try the waffles. Mmm. The waffle is pretty tasty. It's good. Yeah. It's like light sugar on fruit and the waffle is really crunchy. What do you think of, uh, of the brunch so far? Of course, Ann has her brunch hat on. I do have my brunch hat on. <laughs> it's really good. And I really like that they brought it out in small, smaller portions so you're not kind of like forced to eat uh -huh. a lot of one thing at the same time. So you get to like try a bunch of little things. Yeah. This is the salmon ceviche. So I tried the salmon ceviche. It was alright. I thought the salmon was a bit on the fishy side. So let's see if this uh, tuna tartare will do the trick. 
Got a little crisp tortilla chip right here. Got the avocados. Try it out. Surprisingly, the tuna is fresher. Which is weird because I usually prefer salmon. Still, both pretty solid though. All right, guys, we're doing the oysters. Cheers, oyster shot. Mm. That one was icy, but yeah, guys, I put a little bit of vinegar on that one. But usually, I like to drown my oysters in the cocktail sauce, like the ketchup. I drown it. That's how I like my oysters. How do you like your oysters? What do you put in them? I like a lot of horseradish on mine. Yeah, I hate like, horseradish. Really? Yeah. <laughs> My bad, sorry. I no, no, it's, a lot of yours. it's okay. I love like that kind of, um, like, 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 bird, like, yeah, that kick, and then it kind of, like, burns your, your throat and, like, your nose. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Try out this chicken alfredo. Mm. I'm super basic with Italian food. I go to Italian restaurant, I just get the chicken alfredo fettuccine. I got that last night too, at Lux Cafe. It looks crazy. It's a brunch pizza and there's egg in it. And bacon. So it's like a breakfast pizza. Thanks. <laughs> oh, so we got the truffle fries. And more oysters. Thank you. Ooh, we got more oysters. You always gotta load up on the oysters, guys. Take advantage. Let's try these truffle fries though. Mm. Very fried and truffle. I think we tried a little bit of everything of the brunch menu, you know, small items, but what we're about to do now is we're just about to go in on the rest of these oysters and we're gonna keep loading up on oysters to get the bang for your buck. This is our third or fourth dozen oysters. Getting it in. Like this is the fourth, fourth dozen. Right? So we had, dozen, let me see if my math's correct. That's 48 oysters. Hey. Guys, this is crazy. This is an Oreo stuffed baguette. Fire. So, you guys, this is a very interesting brunch. So, usually there's not like pasta at brunch, but this, because it's an Italian place, the pasta they even bring out was really good because they make it fresh to order. So, yeah, guys, that's pretty. That's a, an interesting thing about the brunch here. There's, It's an Italian brunch. But, yeah, guys, I'm still going in on these oysters. They're so fresh and good. Alright guys, so shortly after that, we just killed the oysters and the rest of the brunch and just enjoyed our time here, but overall, this was a pretty solid brunch experience and all-you-can-eat oyster experience, and yeah guys, so if you like this video, like it, comment down below where we should visit next, and subscribe for more food vlogs. Deuces!